person got that one. Wow. It may be We have Go Human down in, in the main portion of Riverside right here on Mission Inn Avenue. We've got Plaza furniture and people are enjoying that, playing some Jenga. So proud of our city to be thinking about innovative ways to protect pedestrians and to encourage foot traffic and bike traffic. So we have three different projects that are part of this overall effort. We're working on three different intersections and we have things that we're doing just for today as a one day demonstration. There's also components to this project which will last for three weeks, possibly even longer. So here is where people can get their passport maps and there are different stations um, along the path here where they can do different activities. So here we're asking for feedback on all of the different interventions um, and demonstrations that we're doing. So we're at Mission Inn and Lemon here in downtown Riverside and what we've done is create a very large curb extension with these temporary materials. So here we've got a um, vertical stanchion here. It's a little bit more aesthetically pleasing than say an orange traffic cone. We've got just two inch uh, duct tape here double lined um, so it's clear that you're not to enter the space as a motorist, obviously. We've got a plant here and plants up and down the street. This is just to define the space a little bit more, add some beauty. And what we're able to do on this one-way street is find all this extra space that is hidden in plain sight and reclaim it. And then through the middle, we put in a um, diagonal scramble crosswalk to shorten the distance from the desire lines that people have to cross the street diagonally. This is scary. That's different. All right. <laughs> fun? Did you have fun? Oh yeah, so fun. it is. The pedestrian scrambles and the curb extensions are very visible. It shows that we're putting pedestrians center stage, prioritizing safety for people walking through our downtown. It's safer. It's quicker. I, I always want to do it anyway. I do. Hey, it's great. Um, I want to see more of them. It shouldn't feel weird to be in the street. The streets are for people. I think they're amazing. They will save time, lives. It's just what we needed. We have signage out at all the different um, traffic demonstrations, and that's to get people to really understand the point of why we're doing it, and also to give the city of Riverside feedback um, in case the city eventually wants to implement these things permanently. Well, this Thursday of the month, we have the Arts Walk, and that's a big event, and that's why we wanted to hold it in conjunction with the Go Human event, because we can really showcase the art out in the crosswalk. We hired a local artist to do that. We're doing a, a, an orange, you know, something the city you know, we had to do some sketches and they actually went out with, with an orange, with an image of the fox. Uh, just kind of orange resembles more of the city, so that's kind of what we're working on right now. I love the pedestrian scramble. I think it obviously improves the safety aspect, and especially when cars are turning right on reds. And... Did you like being in the middle of the street? I love it! Yeah. This is great. It's a great, great. idea. <laughs> it was great, yeah. I mean, it, it's, it's like... a little overwhelming, but then you realize that all the cars are stopped, so you're safe. So, yeah. But if you forget where you're going, you can just change your direction. No problem. It makes it easier to cross the street. You don't have to worry about cars necessarily turning right on red. So it's a much, much better way of handling pedestrians at an intersection like this. So at um, Market and Mission Inn, we've got a three-week pilot project underway with uh, the city of Riverside. Now this is an intersection that's got a very high volume of traffic, but it's also the gateway to downtown Riverside. So the idea is when all the pedestrian traffic that does congregate there, that the scramble treatment will provide them a safer and faster way to cross the street. I think this is a great idea. I like the benches too, and I like the crosswalk extension things, but this is the best. I think if Riverside picks one thing to do, this would be it. And so I see us continuing the momentum when it comes to you know, traffic calming and pedestrian and bike safety. And so I'm just proud to be the mayor of Riverside at a time when we're looking at these innovative ways uh, to make life better. To